All right, once you have taken all your photos and put them into your folder on the drive, you're gonna get on your Chromebook or your computer and you're gonna open up your folder that you created for our class. So here you're gonna have all of your photos that you've taken today and we're gonna organize them. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make a new folder. So we're gonna put a folder in our folder so you're inside of your photography one your name photos and this one we're going to just call it project one okay let me just makes it easier so then you're going to click go all the way down to the bottom scroll to the bottom click on shift and click on the last photo so it selects all scroll back up hold and drag into project one give it a second while it loads up and gets into that folder. Okay, then you're gonna open up project one folder and here will be all of your pictures that you took today for this first project. So you can go ahead and click on the first image and what you're gonna do is you're gonna scroll through and pick out your favorite one. So the first scrolling, I would just go through and just see what you have. See if anything really moves you, something that's really different. I like to go through them twice. So I'll go through them once just to look at all of them. Because something in the beginning, you might be like, oh, that's amazing. And then you, th you think you find other ones a little bit later. So I, I really like the balance of this one, like how it's heavier on the right side it's cropped a little bit. So I'm going to click on the three dots at the top and add a star. So that one will be like a favorited one. So it'll be easier to find later. So you're going to go through all of your photos, try and pick out at least five, I would say five to 10. I think this would be a good one for texture. I don't like how a little bit of the table is showing through on that one, but that can always be cropped. It's a nice close up. I really do like this one. It's very different. So go through and add some stars on your favorite pictures that you've taken today. And once you've completed that, you can even check out your pictures that you took of everything as a whole. So this is what's called, we're going to call this a contact sheet. So you're going to do this in the dark room as well. So it's almost like a little thumbnail of all of your pictures before you start processing your photos. And you might see like, I really like this. So I'll have to go back and find that particular photo. I like that close up. So sometimes it's easier to look at this first and then look at all the photos and then start them as well.